Hello, welcome back. Last time I cleared all the obstacles in my way of the final puzzle. And that's what I'm going to do today. Quintessential medium. Unless this goes terribly wrong, probably going to finish in not too much time. This doesn't look incredibly complicated. Okay, so you want me to pull off four salts and turn them into another of those. Easy. I uh, don't have a Venburlo. Okay. Less easy. Don't have any disposal. Okay, wait. Now hold on. How do I turn a salt into... Oh! Oh, with dispersion! You gave me a reason to use dispersion. Cool! Okay, I think I've never used this. Maybe I did once? There probably was an input once of just like simple, you know, here's quintessence, put it in here, put these together, and put them in the output. But yeah, so, okay, cool. All right, I get the idea. So pull this out, disperse it, duplicate four of these, recombine them, uh, reunify them, then put them together. Neat! I love it. Okay, that's a great final puzzle. How will I start? Okay, so there's a lot of uh, area I need to cover here. I'm not even going to consider using a fixed length arm. I'm just going to put a piston here right away. Because fixed length just seems silly for this. And you know what? I'm not going to get too aggressive about optimization here either. Let's just make this a real victory lap. And you know, enjoy playing the game the way I feel like playing it. Have a great time. Because this game is a great time. So, you know, my inclination with this is that. With you, since you can't quite fit, you know, that way, you could go like that. That'd be fine. You could also go like that. Ooh, that's a nice fit. Sure. It's kind of snug, but I think that's fine. Let's pull the reagent from way down here. You think so? Maybe. I'm not sure yet. Uh, duplication will have to happen. It can happen right there, and that's fine. Now I have to unbond. So I like having this far away from where I'm unbonding, just because... Hmm. Just because that means I get a lot of room to unbond. Now where will I bond? Maybe here. That's plausible. It doesn't have to be much. That can be very simple, actually. Okay, yeah, something approximating that. All right, so, uh, sounds fine. Uh, so I just want to peel this apart and stick the salt somewhere like, well, just somewhere. I need to get at the quintessential core. Uh, but yeah, until then I'll just stash the salt, like, I don't know, somewhere. Sure. Fine. I'm not using my track at all, and that's totally fine, too. Uh, at this point, I can totally peel that quintessence out of there, so that's nice. Okay, so pivot left, pivot left. Yeah, I could do that, um, and I probably will. Okay, well that's... no, I don't like that. Let's do it the other way. Yeah, the more comfortable way to go about this... oh wait, I can't reach this. That's gonna be a problem. I can't do this without being able to reach that. I have to be able to reach both, uh, spots on that thing. Because at some point when I unbond something, something will end up there. Oh wait, no, I could reach that. From here. Sure, you know what? Just in the interest of not changing it. 
Let's keep it that way. Okay, so. Uh, so I want to get a hold of this. I mean, that will let me do it, I guess. Something like that. Oh, okay. Well. Uh, that was one too many. Okay, so I don't want that. This is actually enough to get it there. Okay, so that allows me to disperse. Um, I should actually... I'm going to change my approach here. I want to pull off some more salt. You do extend, but instead of that, you're going to plus, grab, minus, pivot, left, right? Also gonna have to retract, sure. Retract again, go right. And then where's everything? Uh, well, okay, sure. So. Mm-hmm. I guess pivot left is the way to go there. And at this point I have enough salt. Has that disconnected the contestants? Not quite. Um, so all of this I want to be accessible for putting on the glyph of duplicate which is where? Have I not placed one? I have, it's here. What an awkward spot, but okay, that's fine. Uh, where was everything? So if I'm holding that there... Sure, that works, I think. Okay, if I'm holding that there, I'm gonna release. Plus extend... Gr no, not extend. Grab, pivot, right. Oh, well, you need to retract in there. Sure, okay, so that frees the quintessence, kinda. I mean, that's f fine. Will that be able to get it out? No. No, okay, so those are in the way. I guess I can go to the right, but that's awkward. Can I do something else? I mean, sure, there's lots else I could do. I think the one I'm going to choose is to turn left right here. Okay, so I think that'll put the quintessence on the disperser, which is currently occupied. Oh, what am I doing? Why did I, what? This seems very confused. So, wait, what am I doing? Really, I just want to extend this? I just want it out of the way, that's all. All right, so extend, release, right, minus, retract, grab, left, release. Okay, so that should make, that should disperse. Uh, oh, you're occupied, but okay, so I've, where I've chosen to stash things is actually very inconvenient for this, isn't it? No, it's fine, actually. It kind of makes sense. Uh, all right, well, this is what I'm dealing with. 
problem. I can't reach. Oh, I can if this moves. So, can I have put you somewhere else? When did I place you? If you'd turn right one more... Hey! Uh, then that'd be a little more comfortable. Because then I could stash this to the right. Ah. Alright, so it's off the train track. Opening up some different possibilities about how to move here. I don't think I'll take them. I'll just stick with my input as it is. You're stashed way over there. Well, you two are going to split apart and then become those. Those four are going to become the elements. That's fine. Sure. Okay, so from here. I guess what I'm going to do is extend, grab, retract, minus, release. Go grab a salt, which is right on the other side of me. Okay, that salt is now air. And I plunk it here. Do I now? I guess I do, because now I gotta stash the components of this while the uh, glyph of unification is being populated. Okay, this is... There are a lot of layers to this. <laughs> I don't like all the turning around I'm doing here, but that's what's happening. Okay, so air gets stashed here for now. That's probably a terrible spot. Let me just preemptively go ahead and extend out a little bit. Okay, so where am I? Well, for one thing, needed to retract. Oh. Well, isn't that something? All right, well, I guess I need to pull the one off the Glyph of Bonding first. That's fine. This becomes a plus. This becomes a minus. Well, strangely, yes, that's not at all what I thought I was doing, but it totally worked. Same number of instructions, you got where you were going. And that means this also needs to be, uh... Yeah, okay, so not same number of instructions here. But it is necessary. Wait a second, there's a dude there. No, I do need to do this the way I meant to. So what I was trying to do... was this. There. So now you are there. You'll have to extend out a little bit, which is totally fine. You're doing that anyway, just in a different order. Great. All right, so air, oh, well, you need to. All right, so air gets stashed uh, here, I think. Okay. So there be uh, whatever this is, earth or something. Uh. Okay, so I should have made an earth. There's a salt here and here. That's going to get real awkward. I think it's okay, though. I'll open up room to maneuver down below, and that'll be fine. All right. So, uh, from here... Uh oh. 
only three. Okay, minus... Oh, wait, I'm not ready for this yet. Uh, I'll show what I did, but it's wrong. Actually, it's not. No, this will fit. So I stashed that there. I grab the salt, I bring it around, and it doesn't collide with that water because it's out of the way. Neat. Uh, but I do need that water. That's fine, I can go get it. Okay, so minus, extend, extend, ex no, uh, no, actually just one, minus. Okay, so now that's uh, an earth. And you know, it doesn't matter which is which, but yeah, okay, it doesn't matter which is which. Uh, I have a problem here. My earth is still sitting on the uh, spot that needs, or water is still sitting on the spot that needs to be fire. No, it's not. I grabbed that. Ah, it's the other way around. That thing is sitting on what needs to be salt. Well, you know what? I'm still doing this. Yeah, this is cool. Uh, so... Release plus, extend, grab, minus, minus, release, retract, grab right, release left, left, grab right, and now that salt is a fire. Cool. Okay, so plus, left, 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 no, only two. Release, and now I have a quintessence here. Great, okay. Uh, let's see what the board state looks like. I think I have two salts here bonded together, a bunch of atoms stashed up there, one still sitting on the glyph of duplication, Yeah. Okay. Okay. So let's get this here. And then start working on reunifying these. So I think I've pulled the water to here. I'm gonna just extend and grab that earth. Am I where I think I am? Gotta do these checks occasionally to make sure. Good. Uh, no, I'm not. I need one more left. That is a full turnaround. Okay. Okay, so right, right, right. Minus. Extend, extend. Grab. Alright, so that gets the air. Retract, retract, right, right. Extend, release. And the fire is there. Okay. Left, 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 grab. R uh, retract, right, right, right. Release, and I have another quintessence. Great. Um, I don't want to do anything with it yet, but I have made it. Okay, so I'm here with my arm there. All right, so left, 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 plus, plus, extend, extend, grab, minus, uh, here, retract, retract, minus, minus, right, pivot left, right. Okay, so now I have a quintessence bonded, or a salt here bonded to a quintessence. Um, not really the configuration I'd prefer, but I'll work with it. Um, so if that's it, then I need to... And that's fine. Alright, so if I'm holding that, I can just... Left plus, I think. Release. Right, right, grab. Left extend, and I've put that quintessence on, okay. Uh, pivot right, pivot right. Was that going to collide already? 
So I have a salt atom sitting here, right? I think. Basically done here. Uh, whoa, what happened? Whoa, how did what? Okay, wait, excuse me? How are you? What? What? What did I do? I have an accidental bond going on here. Right there. Okay, uh, so just dodge that by inserting, it's going to be here. So that'll be a plus there and a minus here. Uh, not yet. Uh, why don't you just go around the other way? It's the sa uh, same... Wait, what? Oh, I wasn't where I thought I was. Where was I? Must have been here. So yeah, just do counterclockwise rotation. There's another quintessence. What are you doing? What are you trying to grab? The salts. Okay. 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 Great. Yes. Yes, okay. Um, actually, no. Instead of that, I want to minus retract. Okay, so release, left... Then I have to plus, plus, extend, extend, grab. Uh, so you're here, here, and here. If I'm there, uh, then yeah, I can totally just turn right. Minus. Which will put the last salt there. Extend. Reset and I'm done, mate. What a cool final puzzle. This sure was nice. Okay, well, sure, fine. I guess I'll just have to retract once more. That is okay. I was thinking there might be a collision there, but I didn't think far enough ahead to realize there actually would be. Okay, I did it. Final puzzle solved. So, I appreciate how this the post-game of this game is very much just, like, a victory lap. You know, it's not, here are all the puzzles we thought of putting in the main game, but, like, they were too hard or too jank, so deal with them after you've played the main game and have this worse experience. No, it's just, like, a bunch of well-polished puzzles that explore different concepts and don't necessarily continue upward uh, difficulty curve. That is just a really nice, gentle, satisfying way to do a post-game. It doesn't have to be super difficulty, super jank, you know. I, it's weird that that's, like, what I expect with, you know, bonus content after a main game. I guess just because that's that happens so often. And it, it is notable when a game like this breaks that pattern. It's a bad pattern, but it is a common one. Yeah, so, right. Uh, let's see what happens when I finish this. Will I get any acknowledgement that I've done everything in the game, I wonder? I suspect no. I suspect it'll just give me the check mark. You know, quietly go about its business. With no special acknowledgements. I believe this. Um... I guess fixed length with no more than three more tracks? Sure, that little, like, you know, backward three shape. Uh, might allow access to everything except for some of the parts of the um, 
glyph of dispersion. So yeah, I'm not sure actually how you'd do that, but I believe that it's possible. Okay, yeah, so no fanfare. <laughs> Everything's done. Well, not everything. Not everything. <laughs> there is still this. Okay, let's play one final game of Sigmar's Garden. First, I want to just look at all my stuff. There's a puzzle editor. What's that look like? Oh, okay. So here are the available tools you can have. Neat. Oh, cool. Okay, so it can be up to that size. <laughs> All right. Well, that's fun. All atoms must be connected. Okay. So that'd be your product. And then reagents created the same way. Okay, and that's all that a puzzle is. Just available tools. Prod up to four products and up to four reagents. How do you do continuous output? Like this. Okay. Cool. <laughs> wow. That is an amazingly simple puzzle editor because you don't need anything more. That's super cool. I wonder... Are there like... I guess there's probably not... If there was a built-in way to see user puzzles in here, I probably would have found it already. Hmm. So, yeah. Uh, great game. Uh, very glad I played it. Um, gives me good feelings about doing other Zactronics games, which I totally would like to do. Um, I was hoping TIS-100 wouldn't just be like a one-off and, you know would be the only one of those that I enjoyed. I played Infinifactory, like, did one, a little one episode LP of it, the very beginning of it, uh, years and years ago, and it just didn't quite click with me at that time. Um, guess I didn't stick with it long enough to get what this was about. You know, I'm not really in the headspace to do this. <laughs> so maybe I won't bother. Like, I'm, I'm just in, okay, cool, I'm done with this game mode. But yeah, it, this was enjoyable the whole way through. It wasn't till like, I started the final page that I was like, okay, you know, I've eaten a full meal here. I've had enough. Um, but yeah, everything up to that point was just like, yeah, this is cool. I'll happily play more. But you know, I'm happy it ended right when it did. Could have ended like three puzzles earlier and I'd be fine, but this was a wonderful final puzzle. Yeah, okay, so very cool. Uh... Happy to have played this. Other Zactronics games definitely will follow at some point. Not immediately. It's good to do something else in between, I'd say. Story was nice. I appreciated that. It feels like it's been a long time since I heard from Anteus or Concordia. Um, they have more to say to me here in Sigmar's Garden, so, you know, I'd love to see what they have to say, but... Uh, I guess I wouldn't love it as much as to get 18 more wins here just for that. Maybe someday if I feel like sitting down and playing this game. I don't know. That kind of thing just doesn't tend to happen. So that probably won't happen. But, you know, <laughs> a perfectly acceptable choice is the last thing we hear from them. All right, cool. Great game. Glad I played it. See you again for something else.